You having a good Wednesday? How's it going? So uh, I guess it's a Wine Wednesday. So um, that's a thing, Wine Wednesday. That could be part of the reason I chose to do this on Wednesdays. Um, so anyways, welcome to my video show called Wine, Songs, and Good Vibes. And um, this is kind of my own little version of Wayne's World, you know, except I'm not in Aurora, Ohio. And I don't have Garth, unfortunately. Um, that would be fun if I did, wouldn't it? Uh, so anyways, I'm in Hamburg Township, Michigan, broadcasting from my home studio. I'm a singer-songwriter, and um, I put music out for film and TV. And you may have heard my work in Hallmark movies or Dance Moms or um, commercials. Uh, anyways, so last week our theme was treasures. And this week our theme is one of a kinds. Um, I couldn't decide if it should be one of a kinds or uniqueness. And uniqueness is kind of what my friend Bill would say is a different level of language. All right, like as far as songwriting. So, you know, to keep it kind of, uh, you know, conversational, we'll say one of a kinds. So, one of a kinds. All right, so um, first I want to encourage you to Follow me on Facebook if you're watching on Facebook or um, hit subscribe and the notification bell on YouTube um, for new uploads. Um, here's the wine for today. So this is Superior Coast Winery and one of a kind. This is from Sault Ste. Marie, Michigan. Okay, Sault Ste. Marie is almost the only one of its kind. There's a Sault Ste. Marie, Canada, that's like right on the other side. So it's the very top of Michigan, um, in, you know, in the Upper Peninsula, bordering Canada. And uh, that's where the Sioux locks are. Um, so anyways, this wine is, is really unique. It's, it's one of a kind. It's white cranberry. So it's a blend. It's a Pinot Grigio blend, and it's white, cr white cranberry. Pinot Gris from Pinot Gris Grapes. Um, Superior Coast Winery is part of Carl's Cuisine up there in Sault Ste. Marie. And they also have a brewery um, called Superior Coast Brewery. And it's a really cool place. Uh, they have one of the best views of the Sioux Locks. And what the Sioux Locks are, um, you Michiganders, you guys know what that is. But people watching from other places, we have a really interesting um, situation here. So the Sault Ste. Marie is definitely one of a kind. There's no other city uh, between the U.S. and Canada. There's, there's no other city in the world called that. You know, we all live in these places like, I mean, I live in Hamburg Township, you know, after Hamburg, Germany. You know, I'm near Brighton. I mean, there's Brighton, England. There, you know, we all live in these places where there's a whole bunch of them, but there's only one Sault Ste. Marie. Um, so, what happens up there at the Sioux Locks is uh, Lake Superior, the, the northernmost Great Lake, is higher, it's like about 21 feet higher than Lake Michigan and Lake Huron. Lake Michigan and Lake Huron are connected. Um, so, the boats going in and out of there, you know, it used to be rapid. So, they built these locks where the, the boats go in and then they either, either raise them up, you know, fill it with water, and then they go out in Lake Superior, or they come from Lake Superior, and then they take out water, it goes down 21 feet, and then they go out into Lake Michigan or Lake Huron. So it's pretty cool, and you can go up there and um, check it out, and you can watch that happening with freighters and stuff, and you can visit Carl's Cuisine and uh, try their fine wines and their brewery and their food. Speaking of wine, I should try this. Yeah. Okay, so, you know, I had a thought today. I don't need to wait till the show to open this. I could, I could have opened this hours ago. Tried it. You know, I got, a, I got a full bottle here. So this wine is a lower alcohol wine. I am expecting it to be very tasty. All right, fruity is what I'm expecting. We'll see. It's good. It tastes like, um, you know, it kind of reminds me of white grape juice, 
but um, you know, it's got the cranberry hint in there. It's uh, it's really pleasant. It's really refreshing. This would be great on a hot summer day by the pool outside. Um, yeah, it's wonderful. It's a great summer wine. So we have white cranberry Pinot Gris from Superior Coast Winery from Sault Ste. Marie, which is one of a kind. Superior Coast Winery, of course, is one of a kind. And um, okay, so moving on. So that was our one of a kind about our wine. And uh, it's very unique, right? So um, the song I'm going to play is about embracing who you are. It's embracing your uniqueness. Um, this song is called Beautiful Truth, and it's one of my songs, all right? It's one of my original songs. And, uh, you know, it's a special song because, you know, I wrote this song because I felt like it needed to be said. Um, most people are just terribly critical of themselves. You know, they're always criticizing themselves and they, they feel like they're not good enough and, and, you know, they're always putting themselves down and, you know, we're bombarded by messages in society, you know, telling us what's wrong with us and, and sometimes even by our, our parents and our families and, you know, we're raised in these critical environments and, you know, people need to just learn to love themselves and give yourself those positive messages and just love you for who you are because you are unique, you are one of a kind. And there is nobody else like you in this world. And that's a great thing. And so if you feel like you've made mistakes in life, um, I encourage you to just forgive yourself. Forgive yourself and let it go. Um, be loving. Be loving and kind to yourself. Because you have this beautiful truth inside of you. Um, everybody has, everybody has like th this uniqueness, this guiding light inside of them and we're not supposed to all be the same you know it's our diversity that really makes this world a beautiful place so be who you are don't be afraid to be who you are i'm not generally you know so don't be afraid to be who you are just love you for who you are so this song is called beautiful truth
If you like Beautiful Truth, you can find that on Spotify and on Apple Music and Pandora and uh, all the other places you can find music like Amazon. I'm working on Amazon. You know what? I got to I got to email them and and get some alternate pronunciations of my name because you know what? They have some trouble with that. Um I you know the Alexa kind of works with me like sometimes, sometimes it doesn't. Um so the way you say my name is Predom, so Angela Predom. But I don't think my Echo knows that. So, anyways, I'm going to straighten that out with Amazon. But anyways, you can find that song and a lot of other songs um, on all the streaming services. And uh, next, I'm going to talk about good vibes. All right, this wine is good vibes, I'll tell you. Got to check it out. Speaking of good vibes... I encourage everybody to get to the Upper Peninsula of Michigan. It's it's wilderness. It's beautiful. It's like unspoiled. It's a, it's an amazing place, and it has these you know it has a few cities that are, you know, have stuff that you're used to, like Sault Ste. Marie, where this wine is from, is is one of those cities. But it also has a bunch of like serious backcountry stuff, and um, a lot of space, a lot of trees, bears, wolves. Um, porcupines, you know, all the fun stuff. That stuff's fun to me. I don't know. Maybe it's just me, but you know, oh, moose. Is there moose? Maybe. I know there are in Canada. So anyways, uh, the third part of our show, good vibes. Okay. So today I'm going to talk about the Against All Odds Foundation. And uh, this is a foundation that uh, is out of Lansing and they are benefiting cancer survivors, mostly breast cancer and other cancers. And um, they do some wonderful events. Um, in fact, the, uh, the festival, I was gonna say the gig, but let's say a more people-friendly word, right? The festival I'm gonna be a part of this Saturday, um, this weekend actually, it's running all weekend. It's called the Michigan Chicken Wing Festival. Guess what they have there? Yeah, they got wings. And, uh, and live music and stuff. And that is in Lake Orion, Michigan, uh, this weekend. It's at the Wildwood Amphitheater. And this is um, a benefit for the Against All Odds Foundation. So you can get some chicken wings, you can um, help support Against All Odds. Now what they do is they do some really cool stuff. Um, it's not just, you know, it's not your typical, you know, cancer kind of charity. What they do is they offer very personal support. They offer emotional support and other kinds of support for uh, people who need it that are undergoing um, cancer. Like they they buy groceries, um, they give rides to treatment, they will uh, supply clothing um, if you have weight loss or weight gain from from you know from cancer. So anyways, th those are the kind of things that Against All Odds is doing. So it's a really great thing, and um, and they do uh, other events. They're going to do a Michigan Chicken Wing Festival in Lansing on Labor Day weekend. They've been doing that for a few years, and I've also been a part of that. Um, it's a great organization for a great cause. And, uh, you know, if you like chicken wings, like so many people do, you, you know, you're all set because they got like a whole bunch of them there, you know. The only ones that don't like this festival that I know would be the chickens. So if you're a chicken and you're watching this, stay away, all right? You know what I'm saying? Okay, so I want to thank you for tuning in. Wow, this flew by kind of fast. Hope I remembered everything. Um, so yeah, so I will be uh, 6.30 on Saturday in Lake Orion. 
is my set time. I'll be with drummer Ray Page, and I'll be playing um, a set of mostly original music and Lake Orion at the Michigan Chicken Wing Festival this Saturday. It's also called the it's Michigan Chicken Wing Unity Festival. Unity, we're all coming together against all odds foundation. It's a great thing, you know, and I think the weather's going to cooperate. I think it's going to be great. Um, so if you are watching this on YouTube, please subscribe. If you're watching on Facebook, um, I hope you like my page. And I encourage you to leave your comments. I, I love getting those. I love knowing that, um, you know, it reached somebody and you had a thought about it, you know. And uh, I know you guys are way above being trolls, especially in my beautiful truth one. Now that would be bad, you know. But nobody I know is a troll, so we're all good there. So anyways, uh, I will be back next week. So next Wednesday, I'll be back with another episode of Wine, Songs, and Good Vibes. And uh, thanks for hanging out with me. All right, I'll see you again. Bye.